Hey you guys, it is me, Sabra. Welcome back to another part of the Windsor Legacy Challenge. In the last part, we set everything on fire. Actually, no, we didn't. We did not. Eliza did. Oh my gosh, I need a freaking new mouse. I'm about to get so annoyed recording today. Girl, I'm not in the mood. My mouse is glitching out so bad. I don't know if you guys can see that, how it just kind of like bounces back and forth. I don't, I don't even know. Um, but off camera, I did a few things. I had Kane call a maid. Yes, we will now have a maid because this house is a mess. They can't take care of it. They're both slobs. So we have a maid. Uh, today, my only goal, my only goal is to age up this beautiful baby. Well, not today. I guess tomorrow, which is Monday. Um... But she, oh dad, come over here and change your baby's diaper. Let's go ahead and change your dirty diaper. What else did you need? She's socially lacking and she needs food. So we're going to tickle her. We're going to snuggle her. And then we're going to hold her and <laughs> feed on the floor. So there's that. Um, Eliza went to bed like super late. She's super stressed because like, you know, she set the house on fire. Um, she peed on herself. She's pregnant now. So she's, yeah, look at that. <laughs> she's pregnant. Um, so yeah, look how dirty this, how they have not done laundry in so long. Oh my gosh. I can't, I can't handle them. Ugh, I don't know why my sound sounds like that too. It's creepy. Um, oh, look, is that our maid? Is our maid here? Where'd he go? Hello, maid. How are you? Is a maid? Oh, wait. Do we have two maids? Who's this? Eduardo do it. And, um, what are you? Are you or Tanya? Okay, well, they sent two because our house is so big. And the firefighter is still here. We need to ask them to leave. But we have no, like, I don't. I don't even, I don't know what's going on. Why can't you leave our house? What's your name, sir? Maybe we need Diana Beaver. Let's go ahead and reset Sim. There. Cool, now she's not <laughs> in our house. What are you doing? Why are you chatting with someone? Why? What is Tessa doing? She's being picked up. Does she already eat? Oh, I guess so. Well, let's just let her. No, Daddy, dur, don't don't pick her up. Let her play. We'll have her, I guess, um, play. Yeah. Why is this firefighter coming back? Who are you, Diana? We don't want you here. We do not want you here, Diana. She's having no fun. All right, go ahead and wake up. That was a close call. Good job at the extinguishing the flight. Oh wow, thanks. Thank you. <laughs> Since you sat here and stared at it. Um, I'm going to have Eliza come in here and play a little music just so she can um, <laughs> play out her blues, I guess. You guys should be more careful next time. We know. We know we should be more careful. We get it. <laughs> oh my gosh, please. Please don't, don't ugh, tell me what to do. Keen, what are you doing? He's watching TV. Why don't you go ahead and I feel like the maids didn't clean everything up. Let's, see, let's serve some mac and cheese. Speaking of food, I want food. We're going to replace our cake for $30 since we need a new one. And then we're going to, I, I want to sell this one. Oh, now we have a, nope, not what I meant to do. Come on. Yep. Darn. <laughs> Did I hear a cop car? What? What was that? Why is the maid just standing outside? Kane's a vegetarian, which means he likes to prepare vegetarian alternatives to some common meat laden dishes. Cool. Why are, are the maids? Ah, what gee, are you doing? Oh my ah. goodness. Can you not just like come and clean that up? All right, go ahead and recycle these newspapers. Go ahead and recycle them, girl. Even though you're stressed to the max and you're having like no fun. Oh my gosh, look at her pregnant belly. Dang it, she changed. Well then, and then after she's done, no interaction available. No, nope, there is. There isn't an action available. Uh -huh. I'm kind of tempted to just age up little baby at home, but I really want to have a birthday party for her. Although, dad has work tomorrow. Maybe if we have like an early birthday party, Kane is ready to jump into the frying pan. Oh my gosh, if he sets the kitchen on fire because he doesn't cook, 
All right, so Kane is done making the food. We're gonna go ahead and I guess call household to meal. He doesn't need to grab another bowl. Eliza will need to grab a bowl. Is she having fun? Okay, her fun's going up. It's almost 10 o'clock. Tessa, what are you doing? She's still playing. That's good. That's good. I'm so glad our maid is like doing our laundry. <laughs> I like how we have to have two maids though. We're so, we're so needy. So needy. All right, I'm gonna send everyone to bed, I do believe. Uh, there's not much for them to do. <coughs> Excuse me, looks like I'm all done here. That'll be 125. Wait, are they both going to charge us 125 millions? Cause that's not okay. That's not okay whatsoever. Um, Kane, yes, he's putting our little BB to sleep. Eliza's eating her a bowl of mac and cheese. And then, yeah, I'll send them to bed. And I'll see you guys in the morning. You better put those up as leftovers. I'm not even playing. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so Eliza has woken up. I'm, oh my gosh, her belly's glitching out so bad. I'm having her use the restroom and then she's going to shower. And then Kane, oh gosh, he's about to pee himself too. I knew it. Go ahead and use the toilet. Um, I don't really know. I may wake Kane up very, very soon though, because I want to throw, I want to throw our little one a birthday party <laughs> before he goes to work. <clears throat> and he goes to work at one o'clock. I already knew that. So after she showers, we're gonna go ahead and um throw a party at. I might as well go ahead and put that cake in her inventory. Come on. I need you to well, look at that pregnant belly. <laughs> her hair. What is going on with her hair? All right. For our destination, I wanted it to be outside, but since it looks like it's cold, I don't even be able to do that. Is this the civic center, I guess? No, I don't really want to do it there. Um, um, I don't know. I kind of want to do it closer to home. Uh, not a barn hotel, the old train depot, little stream. What about over here? What is this? Is this a bar as well? The Gator Shack? Oh, let's just do it there. I don't, I mean, I don't know what else. To, <laughs> I don't know what else to do. It's going to be a birthday party and it's going to start at 9 a.m. Casual attire will invite all of the family. So the Lassers, um, Kane's acquaintance, Eliza's acquaintance. I don't understand which one is his sibling. So we're going to invite all of them. And then we have some roads where, there we go. Ellie, Jack, and Lucas. And I think that's all we're going to invite is our family. That looks about about right yeah all right why can't i the time you have selected is invalid it's too early for some sims all right 10 a.m dang it 11 all right cool we're having our birthday party at 11 a.m oh, don't please ellie stop hitting on her husband please stop oh my gosh it's tessa's birthday today she embarks on the next stage of life we know it's her birthday um I think I'm gonna go ahead and have Eliza go downstairs and she's gonna cook us a meal and we're gonna bring it. We're gonna serve breakfast. We'll have some waffles. We'll bring some waffles to the party. I feel like that's a, that's a good plan, you know? You know what I mean? I'm, I'm all for that plan. Kane, are you waking up? He needs to hurry up. Okay, stop, stop, stop sleeping, stop sleeping. Stop it, go to the bathroom. <laughs> It's that most wonderful time of the year. The winter festival is here. Whoop. Yay. Play computer games. No, don't play computer games. Don't play computer games. Is the meal done? Cool. Eliza, go ahead and take these. Put them in her inventory. Now let's go ahead and travel to <laughs> the Gator Shack. Oh, why? Oh, it opens at 11 a.m. Cool. Well then, I'm gonna go ahead and speed this up a little bit until we get to, I don't, I mean, I guess we could like <laughs> go here with Kane and Tessa. 
Let's just do that. Because I don't know what else to do. <clears throat> Ugh, I'm sorry I keep clearing my throat, you guys. I just don't... I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I don't know if I'm, I don't think I'm getting sick. It's just, ugh. What is taking them so long? Come on. What is taking you guys so long? Eliza, are you, why is Kane just standing outside? You come in, what you doing? Go here with. Um, are you grabbing the baby? Who's, okay, dad has the baby. You guys, come on. Oh my gosh, if Eliza ruins this one more time, I might have to kill her off. <laughs> what is she doing? All right, stop. Just stop that. Let dad go by himself because he's doing... Where's the baby? Oh, in his hand. Go. Dude. Oh my gosh, I'm about to flip out. Why can we never get this crap together? Visit Gator Shack with these two. Go. Dude, go! Ah, oh, stop trying to put down the baby. Eliza Roach just went to a dive bar. I'm about to bring our baby to a dive bar. Why is he just sitting here? Stop! No, you're not going to work. Oh my... Mm. I really don't understand. This family. Alright, it looks like Kane is late for work, but whatever. I'm trying to put the cake on a freaking table. But I, oh, wait, there we go. All right, fine, cool. Let's just go ahead. Oh no, I'm not having Eliza do it. Kane, come here and blow out candles for Tessa. Even though she's crying because she's hungry. But once she blows out her candles, she can eat from the cake. We're having our daughter's birthday party at a bar. Cool. <laughs> we are just such great parents. Good job, Eliza. Proud of you. And then I'm gonna go, are you not like celebrating your daughter's birthday right now? Why did we not just blow out the candles? Are you for real? You put down your, mm. I really don't know what to do right now. Oh, they're making me so angry. Oh, okay. Blow out candles for Tessa. If this does not happen, I'm just gonna age her up manually. Dom. You guys are getting on my every last nerve. Like, is he not blowing out the candles? For Tessa, what is going on? Is mom doing it? No, please no. No. Oh my gosh. Well, at least this isn't our lot. So is she feeling she doesn't have an unlucky moonlight today? So hopefully... Come on. Please work. Please work. Come on. Come on. Please don't set things on fire. The baby is coming. Are you kidding me? The baby is coming. And we're... Oh my gosh. What? What? She's freaking out because the baby's coming. Oh my gosh, but we're like celebrating the birth of our other child. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What a day. We're having our baby on Tessa's birthday. What a day. Come on. Oh, birthday was a failure? No one aged up? No, we're aging her up right now. What is the issue? We're just gonna have her let her have her baby here because I don't know what else to do. Come on. Why can't Tessa age up? What is going on? Oh my gosh, I'm about to. For real. What is? He's what? He's ordering a regular drink. Okay, Kane. Okay. Well. Is she going to the hospital? <gasps> Happy birthday with crawling cribs behind her. Tessa has finally, finally, Tessa aged up. Yes. What is this? She's having her baby. Where? Where are you going to have the baby? Are you having the baby outside? Baby is coming. Where are you going? Eliza. Where are you going? Is she going to the hospital? Like, okay, well, we're going to let you do you. We're going to um, celebrate. <laughs> 
Tessa's birthday still. I need to take her into create a sim and change up her style a little bit. Um, I can't really see what she looks like. Let's just see. Oh, she's still really pretty. Okay. All right. I can live with that. I can. She kind of looks like her her dad. <laughs> All right. Good. Good. Good girl. Good girl. We're just going to let mom have the baby on her own. We don't even care. Okay, bye. Cheap drinks. Happy hour has begun. Oh my gosh. Tessa, do you want a drink? She can't. Eliza was paid under 50 dollars or some millions not dollars oh my gosh is she having the baby now please have a boy that's all i'm asking that's all i'm asking for is a boy if we have a boy oh my gosh i don't even have a name ah oh, dang it freaking girl we're gonna name her we already have tessa let's name her taylor where's the baby at i don't even see it just captured the memory of having a baby parented is a momentous blah 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 all right, well, here's baby Taylor. <laughs> Hopefully we can have a boy. I'm, I'm going to have them try for a baby again really soon because we need a boy. Like, I'm tired of having girls. Um, you guys, I think we can go ahead and end this part here. It was kind of dramatic. I don't know. We always have issues with these two sims trying. I don't, I don't even know why they don't want to age up Tessa, but whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you, and I'll see you in the next part. Bye, guys.